Hello, my name is Patricia McNeely. I am an Illumin Twin Flame from Chicago, Illinois. And uh, today is Friday, August 8th. This is the Lion's Gate. We're heading into another full moon. But I'm not going to talk about that. Um, I want to talk to you about the webinar series that I've started. I had my first webinar out um, in July. It was for the transition from June to July. And thank you to everybody who already purchased that. This is somewhat of a uh, commercial, letting people know what's out there, what's available. And I did produce this with the intention for you to gain mastery in your union. And for many people that I do speak to during sessions, uh, people that write to me and some of the people that watch you are still um, getting together with your twin. And so it's not only for twin flames or people that are waiting and expecting. This can also be used for people that are in their unions. It's also for people that are divine counterparts. People whose soul has never quite separated to the extent that twin flames are separated and in some cases, yes, have experienced a soul tear. So this is particularly for Blu-ray twins. It is for uh, many people that are now uh, coming into their 5D union. And it is for the sacred sexual and um, sacred sexual union. So, hello to everyone in Twin Flame Landia. Here is something that is intended to be very user friendly for you. Um, the July webinar, I covered an introduction pretty much of what we are and how the runner will return or the runner dynamic, runner chaser, and in many ways um, even that is diminishing. So for all of you who may have been doubting that you know this isn't happening or it's not happening in this life, I want to just say something to you. Some of the damage and trauma that your twin has experienced is being healed. Some of you are healing it for yourself and on behalf of your twin from within your body. This is intended to assist you in doing things like that, in opening your channels, expanding them within so that you are able to very be deeply intimate when you do come back together. And a lot of the things have uh, quite literally gotten out of yourselves. Right now at this time we're cleaning and clearing the rest of the central nervous system People are going to be experiencing irritations, annoyances. Uh, it's also the central nervous system of the collective, things with the internet, um, things with other people, sometimes from the least expected place. This is all to pop things out of your union so that you can experience a really wonderful time of daily living with each other. So there is, there is a high purpose between some of the strangeness that's going on. Um, we also, I did have four positions for your basic merge for breathing and um, to also alleviate certain parts of your body. So a lot of people are experiencing um, things with different viruses or feeling like they have the flu or for a lot of people um, the digestive, the intestines and all of this is having to do with um, the bugs the intestinal flora, bacteria, funguses, and um, viruses, and everything is getting out of us, which is why you see some of this in the media. Um, you'll see a resurgence of different uh, illnesses that we haven't heard of in you know decades, and now here it is again. And there's a reason. This is representing all of the decay and the death of the old right down to the elemental level. So if you think about it, what does bacteria, what do funguses, what do um, yeast do? They break things down into their molecular components and it, it goes back into the you know, outer system, it goes into the ecosystem, but it's also your system. It is all you know, five to, for Blu-rays, uh, it can be more of your bodies than that anywhere, you know, five to seven bodies system that is getting cleaned and cleared very subtly. So this enables you to 
work with your own energies, work with your own inner light body in the smallest way because you are all things great and all things small. Right now you're taking care of those subtle things, the things that sandpaper you, the things that annoy you and irritate you because you can't push out your twin in favor of different annoyances that come up or things on the media or accidents or, or things that just happen during the day. Leading us into this month, August, and the webinar that I just produced is called August Ablaze. We start to talk about the spectrum of sacred sexuality, the full spectrum. And yes, there are gay and lesbian and transgender twins. I talk more about gay and lesbian twins in this because transgender will be coming up in the future to talk about more. We do exist. And... Um, we are not doing this ascension without gay people who are holding double masculine on one end and lifting up and lesbian people who are holding double feminine and lifting up. We are ascending and we're lifting up the collective and yes, it, it hasn't been safe. This place has not been safe for many angelics, not just um, not just gays and lesbians or transgender people, intersex people who have chromosome uh, differences from other people where their bodies are both. And it's not just the inner body, it's the outer body. Um, children, animals, all kinds of angelics. We're making this safe. We're cleaning and clearing everything down right to the basic components and spreading it out across the universe. So what I cover in the August webinar is the old 3D sex versus sacred sex, the great right. And when we lived as ascended beings, we did, as twin flames, uh, perform the sacred sexual merge. It wasn't really a performance. We literally made love. And this love fueled the crystals. It levitated things. It held up uh, the society, the culture, the civilization that we lived in, in Atlantis, in Lemuria, and in other planets. And we're bringing that back here. And yes, I like to think we're bringing sexy back as well. Really sexy. Not brooding, not extreme. You know, the stuff that is really the true passion, not the drama. Passion without drama. So the great right as it once was, has degraded and it cannot be performed by soulmates because they're not of the same vibration. So I talk about this. I talk about the sexual dynamics. I talk about the energy dynamics. I talk about gay and lesbian twin flames. I'm talking about the shifting that's occurring. It's a polarity shift. And I talk about the divine masculine and divine feminine in their aspects of being electric and magnetic. And finally, I end it with um, five positions uh, that are on little video clips so that you can actually have a demonstration. Uh, I give the demonstration of how these positions are enabling you to quite simply almost effortlessly move your body and to open certain channels, certain parts. You know, how do you let in the electric masculine? Well, that comes in through the pancreas chakra, but how do you position your body to do it? I get into it in detail in this webinar. So um, if you are feeling that you need some additional support for your union, if you want to gain some additional mastery and you want to accelerate and kind of cut to the chase, stop flailing around with the last bits of the mental, emotional, egoic body that's leaving. It's leaving everyone. It's leaving us. It's popping out angers. And this will give you a deep body sense of what you can do and what, you know, what is going on, how to feel your twin again, how to get information, how to get clarity, guidance, how to calm yourself, how to keep your twin from being out there or being exposed to seductions, flirtations. So you'll see that um, when you, if you do get the webinar, um, how this can help. Um, this is intended as a support 
there's not really a how-to manual in terms of like this is how you have sex this is how you do the merch that is very unique to each couple and that is going to be something that every couple has to explore together that is why this is called the five uh, prime positions because it's a primer it's a primer to prime your body for flowing together so thank you so much consider it an investment in your immortal soul because it is this is um, for many people the pain that they're in it is boiling down to it feels like a life or death situation it's feeling like you know I've died a thousand deaths in order to do this and be here and maintain um, but the real thing that is happening is that it's the death of the old it is letting go of the old this is quite literally enabling you to let it go out of your body that's to let it go where it doesn't affect you anymore where it feels like well that just happened but I don't feel a thing I don't feel a reaction that's when you know you've mastered it it's not being the master it is being harmonious so um, I wish everyone a wonderful weekend fasten your seat belts for some of us it still will be bumpy it still will be confusing um, but hang in here because um, for many people you're coming into your time the next wave is coming September the next one after that December we're continuing this this is not anything where the universe is dropping you on your rear end this is stepping up to the next level so thank you so much for your time thanks for watching thank you to everyone for just your wonderful comments really thanks for being on the journey because um, we need a certain number of people to do this that's the honest truth and we're here now and that's why I say it's time and it's time for a lot of people so thank again thanks again and um, have a wonderful time be sure to take good care of yourself bye now